All right, hi, I'm Eric Bauer with uh, Gamer Paper, and this is Gen Con 2012, and uh, this is a uh, Through Gamers Goggles review. And what we're looking at today is the uh, Mega Dungeon, which is that giant map you see behind me, and that's just a little bit smaller than what the actual Mega Dungeon lays out to be. This is the Mega Dungeon, it's 100 pages, and each one is a unique map that lays out to form the entire Mega Dungeon. One side is furnished, like this right here, the other side is blank with no furnishing, but it still has the dungeon so you can fill in your own uh, accoutrements. Uh, you can, uh, it also comes with a key, so if you want to make your, uh, your own dungeon, most of the entrances and exits are at about the same spot, so it's very geomorphic. You can twist and turn it uh, and do a lot of different things with it. Uh, so that is the, uh, the Mega Dungeon. I can give you an example of, of what someone has done with this. Uh, we had Monty Cook, Brian Cortijo, Ed Greenwood, and Stephen Shandy write a shorter adventure uh, using the Mega Dungeon and laying it out how they uh, how they chose. So, for instance, Monty laid it out like this and wrote a uh, uh, an adventure, and then uh, Ed Greenwood laid it out this way and made his own adventure. So, really, the possibilities are endless, and that's the uh, All Stars take on the Mega Dungeon. And I would like to thank uh, Through Gamers Goggles for uh, giving me this opportunity. And uh, thanks very much. Oh, the pirates. Ah. And if you'd like to hear about the pirates, this is a Pathfinder compatible uh, pirate encyclopedia. Uh, it has everything from uh, some new races, including a uh, uh, half man, half uh, uh, octopus race that can do different things with its tentacles. It can be doing a skill check while it's uh, fighting or doing something with its actual hands. It's got all kinds of uh, class options, new weapons, new magic items. Uh, some of the new magic items are uh, uh, figureheads for ships that allow uh, everybody on the ship a certain ability or an enhancement. Uh, and then it also has in the uh, third chapter, is almost exclusively for the DM about how to run a convincing and uh, accurate pirate campaign. It's, uh, it's really cool. So that is the Pirate Encyclopedia, which is our very newest product. Okay. Now, um, how about your paper? What makes your paper unique? Well, the yeah, paper is... Uh, no, I don't think you are. Yeah, the paper is, is we 30, had inches wide, 12, 30 inches wide, 12 feet long. So you just put it in. Is yours just the regular one? So you can draw up your maps beforehand uh, and then unroll them at the game. Don't waste the game time. That's really why this was developed. My DM takes forever to draw up. We play once every two weeks. I hate losing time to him drawing a map. Uh, so, we, so we made the uh, game paper. Now, the great thing is, you return to that same spot, you don't have to draw it again, you've already got the, uh, the, the maps archive, the way to pull out again. Uh, and that tremendous amount of paper, the uh, manufacturer suggested retail price is about $4 a roll. So, the roll is 12 feet long, right? A roll is 12 feet long, it's, a, it's 30 square feet of paper, it's a, it's a great value. So that's the, uh, the game. Hey. Thank you, Eric. Thank you, appreciate it.